automatic supersonic hit now that funky fresh see ya <laughs> even if you try you wouldn't understand it maybe something's missing inside of you good morning sassies it's sammy welcome back to my channel and welcome boo if you are new make sure you guys are subscribed if you haven't done so yet and put in your notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads and like this video so i know you guys want to see more from me it is currently 10 04 in the morning today's a tuesday and today's gonna be a traveling day for me i just threw some really quick barrel curls and my hair with this wand by foxy bay i'm just wearing some black leggings and this really pretty past the blue top sorry guys the lighting is a bit weird but i packed everything i'm going to be taking with me in my louis bag <laughs> i hate to like carry this around all the time but i literally bought this to be my everyday bag because it just is so handy if you're thinking about getting this bag or if like you're not really into designer but you want to buy your first bag i definitely recommend the lv um never full i have the gm so it's really big in here is surprisingly my clothes so i just have a change of underwear um i have socks in here t-shirt sports bra um pajama shorts something to sleep in and then i have this little uh skincare bag so i have like skincare makeup soap deodorant that kind of thing in there um i have lotion and lip balm i have some nose tissues a travel size um scent bird this is pink sugar not sponsored but i really do love scent bird because look how quick this is you just turn it spray it and then flip it down so that's great i also have thank you next in here um like the travel size one even though all of my perfumes meet the requirement to travel i have some hand cream as well as this like that's enough i don't need too much lotion some sanitary wipes car charger i always bring my straws my car charger i have my camera case in here with batteries i did bring my flat iron i have my headphones charger that kind of thing and i'm pretty much all set i'm gonna probably throw in the hair tie just in case that is everything that i packed i'm gonna be wearing my doc martens because it is a ton of snow here in pennsylvania i'm just taking you guys along with me in a day in my life and also my vlog for the rest of the week so we shall see what comes up i was facing all the sunlight while our feet swung freely from the bridge the bridge you asked if i'd save you if you were crazy enough to take a swing Chasing fame and being pretty all the time Doesn't sound like fun You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better Fifty-nine North Sam Houston Parkway. That's cute. I don't know where. We're just starving. Starving, starving, starving. Look at me. Stay in here, It's a cute little setup until we leave. You let me know when you want to get out. She said, okay, we finally rest. No outside noise. You, you see? Beat. Record that. Look. So she did her first. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want me to eat? So Denim did her first pee. We were a little worried because we were traveling a lot with the stroller. And she didn't pee. She didn't really eat until we got here. Right, Denim? Such a good girl, Denim. You're such a good girl, Denim. Look at the mess, though. 
What is this called again that she used? Cedar cedarwood? Go Denny, go Denny. Her um go, her go Denny, go Denny, go. Look how she's standing. She's like, uh, what are you doing to me? <laughs> her previous owner used cedarwood to help them go to the potty or cause she doesn't use the bags or the pads. Well we just ordered food and it was treacherous because she asked us to repeat our order like thirty times. Not that that's a problem, but I think maybe our accents are throwing them off. I don't know. Mm, I got pizza. We ordered from this place, Stone Baked Pizza. Or yes, Yesties? Pizza and pasta. I really want to go to the little NASA exhibit. Look at the little NASA suit. And the dolls. Oh, I like this little gift shop. This is so cute. What? I've never seen this little truck. I mean, they have like an eye store. That's gonna stay nice and cold in there. It's the Chick-fil-A being open at like five in the morning. <laughs> Ways. Long story short, I was up and I was just thinking about revamping my channel. Like, I feel like the girly stuff is just not where it's at. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm always going to be girly. I love shopping, getting my nails done, I love hair, like I love all of that. But I don't want to just stick to doing that on my channel. Like, before I even created my sassy vlogs by sam channel i was um sassy sam on youtube and i posted sit down videos covers and all kinds of content but then it was like really popular for people to have a main channel and a vlog channel so that's how i got my vlog channel but then once this channel kind of took off it became like my everything because i love vlogging i love lifestyle content like if you guys ever wonder who i watch on youtube it's like asian ivory Elias face kyra i'm unique like i love lifestyle stuff i like people getting ready sitting down talking i like people going out and doing realistic stuff like grocery shopping you know what i mean like that's just the kind of stuff i watch so would you guys be mad <laughs> if i like do less of all these girly hauls and stuff and i do more of like everyday life i just feel like everything don't need to be a girly haul or getting my nails done because i haven't had my nails done since october like, let's just be real but yeah when people look at girl youtubers like freddie my love or you know what i mean like she's just so like calm and like princess like she's very like mellow and that could just be her natural you know like i feel like that's just how she is i'm kind of both like i can be very princessy aesthetic i can be very calm but i'm also an extrovert i love having fun i can be loud i can be obnoxious i'm very funny probably not funny in my vlogs to you guys but in person everything i do i'm like a freaking jokester so i just kind of want to put more of that out there maybe cater to a different audience i feel like that's probably why i've been like in this rut because i feel like i have to be a certain way to be liked and that's so not true obviously i'm not changing for anybody i'm not like trying to be someone else it's just a simple fact that i am an extrovert and an introvert i like to have fun and be mellow i like to spend time with myself and go out and meet people so yeah let me know if you guys want to <laughs> little taste of me only time I saw that text was said outside and the whole time and I never sent it through. Oh, because I was wondering, I'm like, she said she was coming up. I've been out here. Oh, here I go. I don't know where we want to go. So we just came into it. I thought this was like such a cute bag for spring. Look how cute. I don't need any bags. Why am I over here? So 
so pretty. I love these little, I love this aesthetic. So I came out to go grocery shopping and she has me in here. So now I'm looking at stuff I don't need. I mean, I do need lashes, but I've never tried Morphe and I don't even know what style is cute. Like these look a bit too dramatic for me. I love this. I think this is just such a cute little pattern. But when I seen this, I seen this one. So this is the one I picked up and I put into the cart. It's so cute. And it has like matching headbands or yeah. So this is a turban. And then here's the headband version. And I thought this was super cute, like Barbie-ish. I have some pink little eye masks. These work nice. I like to put these in the freezer or the fridge and put them on my eyes. I thought this was cute. It's like a little pom-pom. Because I just, um, I bought me a detangling brush like this from the Mermaid Company. I just want to buy everything from this vintage company because I love it. The cosmetic company. I literally just bought new hair tools. I can't wait to show you guys when it come in the mail. But I could use like a leave-in type of thing. This is a deep treatment. Curly enhancing smoothie. I've never tried their products. Comment down below if you guys tried. A little lounge pant. Oh, I love this material. So comfy. My foot is not skinny, but okay. Cause I always wear my Doc Martens, but like this is a step up. This is kind of like more dressy. And then you have these that are just like from 10th grade, you know. I'm sorry. <laughs> These are so cute, as if I need any more containers. And I've been looking for these for the fridge for my fruit to keep, but I don't know if I want like the acrylic acrylic, like I might do like a glass. Why am I over here? I don't need to be over here, oh my goodness. These are cute. I've never seen how shoes like these, and they're in my size. They are actually like super comfy, like really comfy. From the Kinsey brand, super cute. And I just bought some of these. Oh, let me just park my little cart in here <laughs> so you can get by. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I just bought some of these and I had bought them in an extra large because y'all can see they only have extra large, but it's fine. But I do love, did I buy blue? Or pink. I forget. But I definitely don't have lavender. I think I've seen this before. So it's just a little love note. So cute, but no more mugs. I actually just got my um, Bridgerton mug in the mail. From my merch line. See, I want some wine glasses, but these aren't wine glasses. They're just regular glasses. It's 24. It's 12 of like the tall and the short ones, which are really nice for $15. These are cute too. Guess I'm not gonna be having any wine. Wait, what are these? Oh, they're just decorations? <laughs> so cute though. So cute to fill it up. That's cute. Look at it. I don't need any more of these. Look what it oh, I love this. What is it? These are cute. Cute. I love this mat. So we're leaving the store. I don't know, I think we're gonna go to the grocery store next. But um, I tried to do good, y'all. I put some stuff back, like two, three things. <laughs> we'll see, I don't even know. I know I put the slippers back because I don't need any more house shoes. Like I have so many, plus I just bought some that look like that. I think they're pink or blue, so I put the purple ones back. 
Can you get my keys with you? I always get totes. And I'm like, can you put everything in here? He's like, sure. He put everything in a plastic bag. I'm like, okay. Cool. Ugh. Then I made a pile of stuff. There you go. That I didn't want. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to just put this back. He started bringing it up. He's like, I'm getting confused. I said, I don't want this, and I want this. I'm like, he must be new. He must be new. Yeah. I'm missing like four more items. When you're like buying groceries, first of all, I bought these, this big old jacket, and it's so warm. When I was like, it's hot, the guy was looking at me like, I can't have on too many layers. You know how it was cold? But when you get indoors, you be sweating. Like, nobody. Oh, yeah, I have. I told him I'm wearing biking shorts. Because the thing is, I get cold up here, and that's why I have on layers. Because I have on like a long sleeve shirt, then a long sleeve jumper, then this scarf, and then that huge jacket. I get so hot looking around for groceries, and then the store was extra crowded. You sure we think the No, this is your car right here, right? No, you definitely don't have a Jeep. Ciao. Ciao. Look, ciao. It's forgetting where the car is for me. <laughs> but yeah, um, comment down below if y'all get like that too. Like, I be real hot. Like, these hot flashes are no joke. And one thing I'm not about to do is shop and sweat. So, that's why I'm wearing what I'm wearing. Individual results $220. Not me finding the pliables. Ooh, this is so good, guys. Oh my goodness, this might be like my go-to now. Cause before I was getting like the patayables, which are in bags, it's like dragon fruit. But it's, you know, dragon fruit, like it's good, but it tastes a little dirty. Like, you know, it tastes like the ground. And then um, I had like half coconut. I think I had like half banana, half, no, half banana, half green the other day. And that was really good. This guy is so cute, but I can't let him know I'm watching or talking to my camera cause he's so cute. Is that even him? But anyways, let me look up the ingredients for you guys. I got this stupid Cupid. Stupid Cupid, stop picking on me. It's my song. It said this pretty bowl is called the Stupid Cupid. And it has a blend, like the blend part, like the base, I guess they call it, is strawberries, bananas, and coconut milk. And then you top it with strawberries, coconut shavings, raw coconut, um, raw coconut, why can't I say it? Raw coconut nibs. <laughs> cacao nibs basically um and it comes with white chocolate drizzle granola and then like a nutella drizzle the nutella drizzle isn't vegan and neither is the white chocolate drizzle so she nixed those um and she also subbed for i added blueberries and peanut butter and it is so good automatic supersonic hit not it funky fresh sierra <laughs> <laughs> Let me spot, let me spot. It's so cute and it's blue. But I only seen it in an extra small. But here's a small. Let's get that. Do we like this color? It's like a looks brown on camera, but it's a green. And we're asking everyone to practice social distancing while shopping and I've never seen anything like this. This is super cute. This is super, does this look Christmassy? It doesn't. I thought it would be really pretty just to kind of. <laughs> 
It's super cute. It's so cute, but I don't know if I should get a small or extra small because my waist is really small. What's the price on? It's $900. Oh, adorable. Look at the door that you open. Aww. And you step and they got steps. On Look. both sides? Steps on both sides? That's crazy. That is cute. Oh my goodness. Look at the little carriage. Oh my God. Now ask yourself what you do with that. Yeah. Well, it's for a planner, I'm sure. so cute that is the cutest little thing you can turn the station oh my goodness that is cute i love this one i want this honestly i can do with this that way i can have it all year round i need to go back to the store because um they didn't have everything i was looking for but i got some boom chicka pop parcels um a bushel or whatever of these organic apples gala crispy sweet and tangy so hopefully those are good some um flour tortillas and i want to try these apple cinnamon rice cakes they didn't have the plain ones so i got those some oranges frozen broccoli and then i got a mixed vegetable just to kind of mix things up got some shelf stable almond milk because I always seem to waste these when it's in the fridge so I have these for when I'm ready to use them I wanted to try out this um, cheddar little stuff so I got these some tomato soup chicken soup um, diet cheese and I also picked up some sonax it's the hair for me what's my background a mess that's what it is 10 44 i don't even know what time i left but i got the baby some stuff and then i also got me some stuff showed you guys my groceries that wasn't that much but you know this is realistic it's a day in my life for the baby i got her four of these little banana things because they only had four left so i was like let me just get all of them so um yeah so those are two three more and then I picked her up some pouches. You guys probably don't care to even see this stuff. They had these Granimal little outfits. They were only $3.98, so like $4 each. I got a 24 months in her pants. Tell me, like, these aren't cute. And I have little ruffles on the butt. So I have this, the matching shirt. And it says, styled by mom. Oops. And I got her shirts in 18 months, because she's only 12 months. And um, her legs is just long. So this is like a big size for her. Like, she'll grow into this and have some space. But her legs are super long, so the 24 months do her well. In case you guys are wondering about her size. Picked up a gray pair. And I'm, like, speeding through this because um, I'm hungry. And then, two, I don't want the heat to come back on. And then I have a black pair. Of course, you need black and gray. Those are staples. With the black shirt, or the black pants, I picked up the Namaste in my crib. <laughs> so cute. Is the other short long sleeve? I'm not sure. It might be short sleeve. And then I picked up these little denim looking ones because my mom, like, she loves, like, baby jeans and jeggings. So, picked up a pair. So cute. And these are not just, like, for her to wear outside. They're just to play in, something to crawl around the house with, keep her warm without having too many layers on. So, that's why I got these. And then I just picked up Her Majesty Has Arrived. So cute. So, that's everything I got for Jenny. I wanted to get her a toy because, like... She doesn't care about clothes. But I didn't see any toys. And then I went to the Sierra store. Picked up this t-shirt. Um, it's Levi's and it just has like a pink little heart. Levi's 73. So cute. And I got it in a small. I picked up an extra small at first because I was like, this is the only shirt I see and I must have it. It's just something to throw on, but then I found a small. And this was $7.99. This is cute. I feel like I'm in Charlie in a chocolate factory. With the golden ticket, Daddy, I want a squirrel. Mm, very rich. Mm, whoa. Mm. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I 
that is not great like the chocolatey part is there but I don't even know how to explain it it's not good ah I'm gonna eat a sour worm mm, get that taste out of my I definitely did not get a golden ticket I also forgot that I picked this up but it's for the baby as well um it's originally 20 but I got it for 10 and it's by Columbia it's so cute what size is this it's 18 to 24 like some stuff um will fit her this might definitely be like a bit too big kind of because she she isn't like walking yet she's trying to take her first steps it's really long but I love that you can either like have them walk and then you can fold it and they don't have to put their legs out which I love so we might give her this option that way she can play in the snow but I picked up um, this organic coconut oil like I said this can be very very expensive not even that I was looking for this but since I just went to the section while my cousin was in the bathroom I came across it and I'm like yes anything else I mean I can use it for my hair I can use it to moisturize my body but I really got this for my teeth <laughs> I'll link something down below in case you guys are interested in what I'm talking about but this is to help like not that I need my teeth whitened but this can be super expensive like I've seen coconut oil for like $15 and this was only $5.99 so check out those stores like TJ Maxx and Marshalls like I ramble I picked up these five pound weights because I'm a rookie but I had one pound weights from Amazon I threw those away because when I lost one the other day I was just cleaning I'm like whatever I'm just gonna throw this away and it's just a purple one because it was either this or like a really dark gray and I started to get gray but I was like you know what I'm a girl and I do like colors so anyways I picked up two of these again they were $6.99 and this is just to help like with arm strengthening upper body stuff when I whatever I start working out and you know how you'd like do like deadlifts and I, I never have anything to hold so I was like I'm gonna use these and people always say you don't have to spend a lot of money on equipment which you don't you don't but I refuse to like hold something like a water bottle or a speaker to work out when I can just invest in these so I got five pounds this is enough for me because they're already heavy and then I picked up this little skirt. I decided to go with a size small in case it shrunk or anything. This was $16.99. It's just like this really pretty ocean aqua blue. So pretty. I'm obsessed with like little tennis skirts right now. I don't know why. And I feel like when I start working out or jogging or just acting like I'm athletic e, then I have a cute little skirt to wear. It's my favorite color. So why not? Nautical boots. Naut nautica. Nautica boots. These are only $24.99, I think. Or no, they were $19.99. Cute. And you guys know, like in the store, I said I always wear like my Doc Martens. And those are cute. Those are like sporty. But these are more like, okay, like I can wear these with some boot cut jeans or like something of the sort. And look more put together. Like I would wear these to an interview versus Doc Martens, like especially in the snow or like the, a rainy day. These would be perfect. It's kind of like, you know what I mean? Like those are like, Doc Martens to me are like mountain boots and these are more like everyday casual. The last few things I got was from the Vintage Cosmetic Company and I'm obsessed. Like I said in the store when I left, I put some stuff back because I always just splurge on a bunch of crap I don't need. Um, but it was so cute not to and because I ordered me some hair stuff for Valentine's Day, I can't wait to show you guys a haul. It's like a girly haul of just... It's not for Valentine's Day, but I'll get into that next week, like about why it's just important to celebrate love and God's love for all of us. And it's really important to love yourself and to celebrate yourself. So that's why I bought new hair tools. They're girly. They're like pink and cute. So yeah, that's why I just got some little hair essentials. But I picked up this little um, headband. There it is. Super cute. Uh, I think everything ranged from like $3.99, $4.99 from this company so adorable you cannot have enough of these then i picked up this little is it cheetah leopard i always get those two mixed up so adorable and the last thing i picked up was this kate spade phone case i don't know if i told you guys when i went to babysit my phone fell in her bathroom and her bathroom had like these really crazy hard floors and my phone shattered like the front of my phone is perfectly fine look at the back you guys see that 
I'm devastated. I do not like when my phones crack. Like, I can cut myself on this. I haven't had a cracked phone in, like, six years. Bought my phone at the Verizon store. I just had picked this up just so I could have a case. And I put this back on there because um, the flimsy ones I get from, like, Walmart, they're, like, $6. Um, when I got tired of those and then they get, like, scratchy. So I just put this back on there. Um, and then I didn't want to cut myself because those were super thin. So I put this more, like, hard, grippy one on there you guys don't care but i'm gonna explain myself anyway long story short i picked up this kate spade one super cute and i've really been looking for a case to cover the back i do have insurance um but my sister said the same thing happened to her so pretty i love kate spade so much and this is only like 15 dollars. it's like this black and gold rhinestone case and it says, I'm all ears. <laughs> I'm all ears. That's cute. Anyways, I was checking out and I saw this. And I'm like, it's perfect because it conceals my scratches, my little cuts versus this one. So pretty. I love it. And it's so sleek. And I love. Anyways, long story short, my sister cracked her phone on the back. And they said that the insurance didn't cover it. Like, she'll basically have to pay for a whole new phone. And I just got my phone. Like, literally, like, a couple months ago. I got a brand new phone. Um so you know, if you know you know like i'm not going through the trouble of paying just to get the back of my phone fixed and i can just conceal it so that's why i got a case but whatever that's everything that i picked up i also got a mug should i just show you guys my mug it's from my merch line it's public or private now because i wasn't sure about copyrights but everybody else makes bridgerton merch and i was like what's wrong if i do it so if you guys want me to send you the link, I can. Um, and I can just make it unlisted where you guys can buy it, but it won't be like in the store. But let me know. I just wanted to be super simple. I know there are so many mugs out there that can say Bridgerton or Duke of Hastings or whatever. I didn't care about that. I wanted just to say, but first, Bridgerton. And then on the back or the front, whatever way you hold your mug, it says Lady Whistledown. Um, society paper is spilling tea since 1813 so pretty and it's just so simple why is it that um you can go in like a ross or something and it'd be like but first coffee but first my dog but first candy and people are like oh it's so cute and then when you show them your mug they're like oh that's so simple and i'm like yeah so is everything else you just bought anyways that's everything that i bought today that's all for this little day in my life happy sassy little sunday <laughs> i forgot to put earrings on Anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Again, make sure you guys are subscribed and put in notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. Like this video and comment if you don't mind me doing videos like this. Like, this is just a simple, realistic, everyday type of day in my life versus, I mean, I still shopped and gave you guys a haul. But you know what I mean? It's a little different than, like, the girly, everyday coffee aesthetic with music and it just gets so draining. Like, I, I love it. Don't get me wrong. It's not, like, fake. It's just... I don't want to be put in a box like I can be a many different things I'm interested in many different things and I kind of just want to share that on my channel because this will be my lifestyle channel it is my lifestyle channel it's just called sassy vlogs because it's like I don't want to say nostalgic but it's been my name for years and I just don't want to change it anyways I hope you guys enjoyed nonetheless don't forget to stay sassy have courage and always be kind spread nothing but love and positivity and I will see you booze in the next one bye I ain't gonna cry too long. No. I'm back on my drip. Yeah. Drip my drip my drip. drip. Right back on my drip.